And I'm about to lose my, and I'm about to lose my mind. Welcome to Link Click Season 2 Episode 3. Um, I was just singing the Season 1 theme song. That's, that's, uh, that's not appropriate anymore. We're doing Season 2. But, uh, look, it's still, it's still stuck in my head. <laughs> but I do love the Season 2 theme song. It's just not, I can't, I don't have the lyrics stuck in my head of that song. Um, especially since half of the lyrics are like weird and backwards and stuff. Um, so we're jumping into this episode. I mean, season two so far, the two episodes we've seen ha has been like so crazy. Like it's mostly the production of it. That I mean, the story has been amazing, but the production of it has set it over the line so much. Like it's beautiful animation, absolutely gorgeous animation. And it's funny to like say that for a show that like, I feel like the art style of the show doesn't um, doesn't imply that it's going to be a beautifully animated show. You know, like it looks like a pretty simple, maybe strange-ish looking art style, I guess. Um, where it's like, oh, this do this doesn't look like you know traditional shows that that I'm used to seeing. Um, but the like they animate it so beautifully, so incredibly well. So last episode we had a two v one knife fight, which was probably probably the best fight scene in the sh show in terms of choreography and animation, in my opinion. Um, like just because of its pure length and how real it felt, like it felt like a real fight. So let's jump into season two, episode three. I'm not going to tell you what my predictions are because I don't have any. I got no idea what's going to happen next. Here we go. Make sure to support the video if you can. Liking, commenting, and subscribing. And my Patreon account is in that description below. If you want the full-length versions of these reactions, uh, they will be on there. As well as early access. To oh my gosh. Early access. You can get the next episode of this. As well as earlier episodes of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Of One Piece for my Gent Watchers One Piece channel. And many other stuff. Uh, Alice in Borderland right now. Lots of stuff. So go check all of that out on my Patreon in the description below. But uh, without further ado, Season 2, Episode 3 of Link Click. Look around, jackass. The ward is closed. Oh. No. It can't be. Oh my god. Simple Star Warrior? <laughs> what a weird way for this to go. Two funerals, okay. Okay, that could be bad. Hey, thanks again for this, Dad. <laughs> I'm not your father. From what we saw of his wounds, they must be mixed up in something dangerous. Good thing Dad can pass for Lu Guang. It gave him a reason oh to my God. get a haircut. Uh -huh. This place is a hospital, not a morgue. So go die somewhere what else. What the fuck is Drag wrong with you? Seat. Get lost! Ah, uh, why are you even here? I thought geezers like you all oh, had no. dead signs. You're too old Gonna choke him out. Yeah, you better leave. Hmm. Stupid old people being here late at night. What the fuck is wrong with you, man? Somebody help! I know he's drunk, but... I'm not having fun and hope my stomach hurts real bad. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> ah! Holy hell, is that a snake? <gasps> oh, that was from the grip. That grown man has it coming. Dad, <laughs> please. Let He's not answering her phone. What? Do you think something happened to her? Jeez, she in the middle is something important. A big you. fight. It looks like it's too late for that. You see those men walking Whoa. towards the building behind us? And You're right. We have to hurry. That was a cool I shot, the run. zoom through I the street. Them out as much as you do. We can't let them see us. But they need our help. Oh they my, so that's why they wear the masks. That's funny. <laughs> there are three there as well. What do you say they were? <laughs> Triple what? <laughs> Star Wars God, do the thing. Say Star of Courage. <laughs> We've got this. Yeah, sure. Trust him. Oh my God, this might be very satisfying. You sound like isn't it late for you? Why don't you go on home and get some rest? Oh shit! <laughs> oh my god! Hitting the stairs like that. I probably don't want to, but you're gonna need to hold back on them. He's right, Dad. <laughs> They're nothing but three old loons wearing costumes. Take them out! Did you not just see how far that guy was thrown? You can't underestimate them after that. 
Oh my god, here we go. What? What was that? White light! Then I woke up and my whole body was screaming in pain. Oh my I saw god. And then I was on the ground. Beaten half to death by a superhero? Come on. <laughs> it was the triple star warriors. Although the he one guy like could well, beat you up on his nowhere. own if you wanted to. I guess to. they're tougher than we thought. Security's much better. The police are patrolling all the time now. Didn't at least three officers are watching me at all Didn't the guy come to your door? They rotate sometimes, just to be safe. And I think mm -hmm. Captain Shaw wanted to make sure that if someone gets possessed, the others can stop him. Mm-hmm. Make sure your door's locked first. You can't be too cautious right now. Wait, what happened with what the end up getting possessed? guy we saw at the door? Oh, okay, okay. Was he it? Is it no, Show me more. Long seem off. Show me more. Everything he's been through, I would be more worried if he acted normally. Oh, I didn't want to see that. No, Captain. You were uh. keeping safe the best you could. I'll ask for a demotion. I got my partner no. killed. No, man. But for right now, I have a murderer to catch. Don't ask for a demotion, please. We love you. Mr. Chen. And First, we need answers, and we know one man who might have them. Mm hmm. Where did you learn to attack? I don't know if he's gonna talk much, <laughs> Guess though. Old pigs can learn new tricks. But we might be able to trick him somehow. <laughs> if you ask me, he did it himself. Why would you assume suicide? Mm. Huh? I mean, yeah, he probably did. He was we probably you were controlled. On the roof. <laughs> well, I mean, he was. I was going we saw up onto the roof to get some fresh Red eyes take the picture. Sound like a sissy was ugly crying. Not about red something. eyes, but the lawyer. He kept saying, I'm sorry, over and over. <laughs> Chen Bean was a good man. No one's gonna believe he was. He's a very good man. Really? He probably should have taken all those bribes then. Oh my Not god. Career move. This guy is such a scumbag. And I think he's voiced by me. Dimple's voice actor, which makes it him even scummier. <laughs> Dimple from Mob Psycho. Well, yes, we're at one I'm... of the funerals. Lu Guang asked me to bring this. He wanted to be here, but there was an unexpected snag. Oh. I swear I'll come right back. It'll be fine. I'm scared Please. for you, Lou. I'm not letting you traipse off so you can reopen your wound. <laughs> Get back in bed. You want your guts to fall out? Fair enough. I should get back in bed. <laughs> Lu Guang needs to rest. What a coincidence. My son's memorial is right oh, next God. to your partner's. Are you here to mourn or finally give us some answers? That's what the second funeral is. Our son died in your interrogation room, and you think that oh, I'm going shit. to some bull about him strangling What's his name here? I'm sorry. He was related to multiple cases. Oh yeah, I didn't think of the fact that people None might think that the police oh, just really? killed him. Better yet, tell me why you killed him. Please calm oh, down. God. Again, I'm sorry. You can't prove it, and the dead can't deny. Mr. Chen, didn't you say we could sue? Yes. Say the word. Oh no. <laughs> When did you sell your soul, huh? I still remember the cop you used to be. Mm. So what happened? <laughs> Justice needs a proof. He looks assumptions. more insane than he did before. He looks more Don't like handsome it. before. <laughs> you hear that? If you can't find proof against my son, look at my his eyes. Will destroy you. <clears throat> Cases. Liu Min was disabled. He could barely move or do anything. And yeah, you well, saw him attack someone. No witnesses. And they'd face charges. <laughs> like, I hate these. Sounds like you better be careful. I hate these two, but also, Life must I kind so of understand. Salary enough for a young officer. To it's not really their ride. fault. Shut up! Scream from the rooftops if I so choose. What? You want to fight? Fine. Go on and hit me, you prick! Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! So rest that man! He was literally asking for it though. <laughs> Fact, Jin Jin, let him go. Not yet. Apologize. Oh man. It Whoa! Ho <laughs> That was the best animated slap I've Apologize ever seen. What? I can handcuff her if you want. <laughs> Let's meet up at the station. Get your statement. <laughs> For this scratch, no. Mm. Doesn't want to escalate it there. You can't just walk away. Enough. Don't embarrass me. Just let it go, okay? 
Let's leave before you make things worse. That slap was so satisfying. <laughs> I took that two years ago, and we still haven't had our ceremony. <sighs> I mean, they keep showing that picture. You're not going to jump into it, are you? Shouldn't I don't know why he would. Where is she? It's getting late. Oh, oh I hope worry. nothing happened what to her. Happened? Uh, what is this? Is this before? She in a wedding dress? Oh, not quite. <laughs> oh. Over here. You finally have some time off and you want to spend it here? I mean, yeah, you'd Why be not? feeling so many feelings Stay right now. Frustration would be one you of them. Break every promise that you ever made me. Oh. You forced it through a movie together from beginning to end. Oh, he was so enveloped in his work. <laughs> so many nights alone. You told me you would come home soon. <laughs> but you never did. I'm almost done, though. <laughs> Damn, man. I'm still waiting. Why haven't you come home yet? <laughs> I chance to meet her father. It just doesn't fair to her. You know that. <laughs> it's too late for you. I to hate this. Promise that you'll pay me back in our next life. Oh. Okay. It's done, <laughs> my lady. <laughs> Man. I was so scared of seeing his wife's reaction and yeah, it hurts. It hurts a lot. Oh. Stupid fucking show. It's been so much pain. They didn't deserve this. Yeah, we're going through so much. Me too. I'm suffering too. We should help them. Help them how? We should. What is it? What is it? How? Yeah, okay. They are jumping back into the photo. Hey, stay right there. So that he keeps one promise to her or something? Uh, sure thing. Oh. Shambin, I'm proposing <laughs> to the love of my life in this moment and everyone after. And thank you for forgiving me even during the times that I don't deserve it. Oh. To love and protect you, not just for the rest of this life, but the next and the next. Oh my god, they go back just to make the promise to her? So will you marry me? Well, duh. I already said yes, right? <laughs> but one proposal doesn't guarantee I'll say yes in my next life. If you keep making me fall in love with you, I'll have to. <sighs> the rings in the jar. <laughs> they keep showing this. Okay, now they're finally showing me what happened. Okay. There's a picture of some pink haired motherfuckers. Okay. Shit, man. They're just. Ah. Uh, I wonder how many. If you don't know, I've got a playlist on this channel called Videos Where I Cry. Um, and it's exactly what it sounds like. It's just every time I, like, find myself crying in a video. And I try to, like. You know, it's kind of subjective to me when I, when the point of crying is between like tearing up or like a tear coming down or whatever. Um, but like, you know, I, I put that on the channel because I think it's, I think it's kind of funny to like one, expose how much I cry and shit. Um, but also it's like, you know, if you're specifically looking for like reactions where I get particularly emotional, because that generally means I'm pretty into what the episode um then you can go watch my videos where i cry playlist or go check it out and see if there's anything you recognize um this episode uh made me cry <laughs> uh where was i going with it um uh i can't remember where i was going with it but oh i wonder how many link click episodes are in there that's what i was gonna say because i think like this series has has made it to that playlist probably like three or four times at least i would think um, they're, they're fucking good with the emotions in this. And it's off, like, the show is often good with the emotions of, like, side characters. That's the big thing. It's like, they, they get me really crying over these characters that we maybe knew for one or two episodes, you know? Like, I mean, this, 
like, uh, yeah, I, I would say the wife is a good example of that. I think we basically only known her for two episodes, like, properly. And, like, and I'm bawling my eyes out, you know? It's just, it's so sad. Um, but, like, s them being at the funeral and seeing those, like, sort of regrets that she had where she's, like, frustrated with him and she feels basically like she's been abandoned because, like, it was essentially, like, all of that time he was so enveloped in his work and he had so much to do and he would always like make these promises of that he would come back and it would you know it would be okay but like he just kept leaving over and over but it's like if that happens your in entire life your hope is that well i'm doing this because eventually he's going to come back and he's going to stay that's why i am going through all of this pain but then what ended up happening was he just ended up dying in the line of duty and it's like he would he like was all of that pain worth it for her then is kind of i feel like some of the regrets she's having like i loved him but like i kept going through the pain of him leaving and now i didn't even get him like he didn't even get to come back for me you know so there was that but at least what they did was they saw that regret and they went back and recontextualized it it seems like where um like he still died you know and she still loses him but at least she, like at least they they put it into words of like i still you know like i will still come back for you in the next life and i like i love you and like something i really appreciate is that you are sticking by me in those times like it's sort of something that i believe he felt but he would have like it would have gone unsaid so instead, like, making sure to give her those comforting words so that she can think back to that in this time of grief. Um, so, like, I I think that's that's a, a nice thing to do for her, and it doesn't change the timeline too much as well, which I think is the big thing, right? Like, they're trying to give people that comfort without changing the timeline, really. They're just, like, sort of changing how people feel, which, man, it just, it's so sad, man. Um... Man, that fucking slap was awesome. <laughs> like, she stepped into that slap and they, they animated the shit out of it. It was so good. I love it. I I just, I really, like, that was more satisfying than, like, a punch could be, I think. It's just, like, l literally a fucking get off him, you know? Um, it was, that was really, really solid. I love that. I love her, um... <laughs> You know the character I'm talking about, the landlady character who I can never remember the name of. Xiao, Xiao Ling or whatever. Um, I love her so much. And, like, I love that they're giving her some, like, dope animation in these episodes because she just is the best. Um, and, um, and, but something that I didn't think of until this episode was the idea of, like, yeah, uh, Liu Min, is that what his name was? Um, like, strangled himself, but of course, like, his parents wouldn't believe that that's what happened. I, I hate them, like, the, the, the parents, like, seem like absolute scum, and it's really frustrating from our perspective to have, like, them doing what they're doing, and yet, can I really blame them? Because, like, even though they seem like douchebags, just, like, their personality seems like douchebags, they, from their perspective, they did have a son who is disabled, who the police were constantly trying to pin crimes on, despite the fact that by every piece of evidence that could, you know, like, the, every piece of reasonable evidence, he couldn't have done it, you know? Like, and so they're just... Like, he's just someone who has suffered through... Now, also, I mean, Liu Bean, I'm pretty sure, was, like, a douchebag before. Like, he wasn't, like, a great guy, even when he wasn't being controlled. But, um... Uh... Still, with that being said, he, um... Like, the, from the parents' perspective, he is just a, um... A... Kid with a disability who the police were constantly abusing over and over and then they bring him in for questioning one day and then he conveniently strangles himself which isn't like as they've said in previous episodes it shouldn't be possible to do that your muscles should give out so like he did something they're they're giving a story which is like 
utter bullshit and it's like so convenient for the police. Like, I, of course, of course the parents are going to be like, well, you, you killed my son. Like, the police killed my son. And I mean, distrust in the police is not... It, like that's a common <laughs> a common thing and kind of like a justified thing a lot of the time because um, Police do a lot of things to make them distrustful But it's just Like but it's so frustrating here because we know what happened and we know that like this guy this like main Chris Sabat voiced police officer um, is a good guy and like cared a lot about his partner and he cares a lot about um, doing things the right way and he like has reason to believe the things that he's believing and he's you know he seems to be doing everything right um, or uh, to the best of his abilities really and yet he's being pinned for this and blamed for it and it's like really frustrating and anger inducing but yeah I kind of can't blame the I can't blame the parents that much even though I hate them I still can't blame them too much um, and then the superheroes at the start of the episode was just awesome. <laughs> that was just really cool. Like, they're just beating the shit out of those guys. That was so satisfying. Even though we didn't see most of it, like, just seeing that one punch was all I needed. One punch! Anyway, that's Link Click, Season 2, Episode 3. Thank you for joining me. Make sure to support this video if you can, liking, commenting, and subscribing. And go to my Patreon account if you want the full-length reaction, as well as early access you can get next week's episode of this show. Um, and lots of exclusive content for both this channel and my Gent Watches One Piece channel uh, on there right now. So go check it out. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.